welcome to politics and trust me it's not as bad as people make it sound it's a wonderful profession to be in and even if there are dark spots it's our job to make sure we wipe them off it's very easy to shout at people and win an argument it's very difficult to persuade people and bring about change we are in the business of persuading people and bring about change not winning arguments and show how clever we are and is that every generation needs to have its own leaders uh, but if we think of india today all our role models either come from bollywood cricket or business we don't have a live role models who we can look up to as young people and say i want to be like this person and this person is serving the country um and seeing this gap uh, we said how can we nurture principal leaders uh, who want to help india achieve sarvodaya which is development for all and want to make democracy work for each and every citizen and you know it's not true uh, when we say that we gave voice to the voiceless uh, to the marginalized they already have a voice uh, when we say we empower the uh, the marginalized they already have power whether you're with the in a left wing party or a right wing party if we all agree that we want to increase the number of women in politics then we must all agree that we have to come together so and i think that itself is the crux of political communication but when it comes to working for the people i don't think that depends on whether you win or lose an election that work will continue and in fact your responsibility is much greater in many senses when you are not elected i really uh, started with uh, looking into the hearts and thoughts of the common people in this country uh, you really realize that uh, large majority of this country really work so hard and it is only with their uh, contribution that uh, the life is on in this country and elsewhere indirectly when somebody is saying steel fly or beda they are saying beda to bad politics they are saying that also but when that converts into the ballot box and all of that that's a journey from them so you get them to oppose the flyover and support the bus you will also get them to support good politics it's going to take a while they are on that journey jab hum ek jagah pe bahut samay rehne lag jate hain aur hum ye cheez dekhte hain ki wahan ki kya kya issues hai wahan kya dikkatein hain aur inko kaise hum society mein as hum inke bare mein kya soch sakte hain ki kya humne koi steps apne dimag mein rakhe hain ki hum in cheezon ke upar dheere dheere kaise work upon kare ki issues na aaye तो मैं क्योंकि इस पंचायत को खुद पिछले 20 सालों में देख रही थी और मुझे समझ में आ रहा था कि जो मैंने पढ़ाई करी है जो मैं दिन भर टीवी में देखती हूँ जो मैं मीडिया में देखती हूँ क्यों यहाँ पॉलिसीज इम्प्लीमेंट नहीं हो पा रही है टू बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट दिस वॉज द ओनली रीजन दर आई थॉट ऑफ यू नो गेटिंग इन टू दिस सरपंच का इलेक्शन दिस प्रोग्राम हैज बिन नथिंग शॉर्ट ऑफ फिनोमिनल फॉर मी the people who were a part of this as part of the cohort were so special coming from different parts of the country added so much value to my life second the content and the speakers throughout the program were nothing short of phenomenal and third and not the least the team at ISD that facilitated this program so beautifully the experiences that we had it's it's something i'm just going to cherish and carry with me for a very long time I think she represents as the name itself uh I think it has helped me reorient uh, or relook into what my values are who am I what do I represent what do I want to represent what do I want to talk about what can I be what can I do uh, three things stood out for me very very strongly from this course one how beautifully it was designed the second thing is uh, how so full it was something that one would not expect from a political course at least i did not expect it uh, there was iq eq and sq which is spiritual portion it really helped bring the unconscious up uh, and the third thing are the people itself which is the facilitators the speakers that were brought in the mentors uh, the cohort itself uh, you know there was so much to learn i grew up always knowing and understanding that politics was a bad word but it was only through this fellowship that i realized that everything that i've been doing for 3 decades has been dictated by politics my experience at she represents has been a revelation the revelation is that of just how powerful and generative it can be when a group of women come together wonderful people are made not born she represents help me to redefine the purpose of my life strengthen the courage of women to come back to the power it helped me 
to identify that the power was in my control, is in my control and will always be in my own control. It is actually, uh, it is listening, being able to listen uh, to those voices, recognize the power and dignity and to add your voice to this. Uh, I think that is what politics should be about.